Hello, Back Talkers. And welcome to another episode. We have a great show lined up for you today. Today, we're going to keep things lighthearted and fun during this pandemic. So, have you ever wondered if an animal and or insect farts? (laughs) Well, today we're going to chat about insect and animal farts. Do they fart? (laughs) And if they do, what does it sound like? And or what does it smell like? (laughs) And 10 other things about animal and insect farts you won't believe. (laughs) And stick around till the end because we'll be playing Who Who Dealt Dealt It? It? So stay tuned. I'm John. And and you're you're watching watching Back Talk. The show that'll make you think, laugh, and realize you're not as crazy as some folks out there. Because of the 10 things about (laughs) animal and insect farts you won't believe. But first, be sure to subscribe, like, and comment below. And hit that notification bell to be notified of new videos that come your way. And don't forget to share with like-minded friends and family. Our featured product of the day is the Telescopic Stainless Steel Straw. By A-Link, comes with its own little carrying case Ooh. and cleaning brush. It's portable, reusable, reusable and, and collapsible, collapsible. see? <laughs> You're gonna definitely need this after the quarantine because I'm not putting my lips on no glasses, I'm not putting my lips on no utensils, and I'm definitely bringing my stainless steel straw and my chopsticks. Oh. Franklin, don't you get no attitude and don't you be offended. That's right. <laughs> but we're not sponsored by them just yet. So A-Link, if you're watching, be sure to hit us up. But now, let's, let's jump into the hot seat. should be interesting. Do spiders fart? (laughs) I would say yes. You say yes? Well, the answer is spiders have a completely different digestive system as humans, so they do not release gas the same way we do. Spiders force enzymes from their mouth into the hole they made in the prey then suck it back into the mouth. So the answer is no. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny, though, if they farted? I wonder if a little piece of web comes out. <laughs> well, there are insects that fart. And in fact, you might be curious to know, do any insects use farts as weapons? Oh. <laughs> uh, I'm sure that they do. <laughs> like a stink bug. You think yes? <laughs> yes. Yes, the answer is, for one, the beaded lacewing spends its larval days in termite nests. When a baby gets hungry, it stuns a termite with a vapor phase 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 (laughs) toxin released from its anus. Oh! (laughs) And get this, the farts are powerful enough to stun six termites with one blow. Whoa! (laughs) Then the baby lacewing leisurely chows down. And there's one other insect. Well, I mean, there are probably more than one, but I also got another example of the bombardier beetle. It farts after being swallowed by a toad. Oh, my goodness. And the hot, noxious chemical forces the toad to vomit out the beetle. Oh. So it's a defense mechanism. <laughs> okay. Do ants fart? Yes. <laughs> well, the answer, and I guess the overall... Conclusion, ants can't pass gas. I'm wrong twice. <laughs> That's, so, 
So that so this is why some of the most effective ant killers cause them to bloat up, and because they have no way to pass the gas, they explode. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, they do not fart. Ants do not fart, <laughs> but so, they do explode. <laughs> sounds like it's dangerous to be an ant. <laughs> okay, well then, do you do termites fart? Oh, didn't you just say something about termites? That was about the the la- lace wing. Oh, the beetle. beetle lace wing. Okay, but termites. I would say yes. Now, why would you say that ants can't fart, but termites can? I didn't think termites were the same as ants. <laughs> well, I mean, they're similar. They have those, those bodies, the body, you know, the pinchers and the bodies that are the segmented bodies. Oh, okay. Well, in fact, yes, they can fart. Wow. And they actually fart quite a bit. <laughs> Get this. They contribute 5 to 19% of global methane emissions. Oh my goodness. That's almost as much as John emits. <laughs> That's not nice. No, but wait though. It must be all that pulp that they be eating from the wood. <laughs> Maybe it's something. Okay. Do bees fart? No. Here's the answer and the exclamation. Explanation. (laughs) Since bees are a multicellular being, pockets of air can and do establish themselves in the fecal matter. When excreted, these would manifest as farts. So yes, bees do fart. (laughs) Okay. So I got all of them, all of them wrong, guessing all mm-hmm. of them wrong. You got one right because you said, yes, the bees, right? You said, yes, bees fart. So yes, bees do fart. I, I can't remember. Yes, <laughs> bees fart. <laughs> well, okay, so, so. I wonder if it smells like honey. Let's talk about the birds and the bees. Oh, gosh. Do birds fart? Oh, that was going to be my next one. Okay, but anyway, I would say no, because I already know. You're correct. <laughs> They don't have the kind of bacteria in their guts that build up to produce farts, but yeah. parrots can imitate the sound of farting. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure they and can. And we have an example we'll show you. Oops, sorry. Well, this is what I gathered from my um, investigation of rather birds fart or not. So birds have an anus and technically could fart. But to date, there's no official evidence that they do. Another theory is that birds' guts don't contain the same gas-forming bacteria or bacterial as mammals. So, Mm -hmm. yeah, so no, they do not fart. Um, Do crabs fart? No. (laughs) You're right. Marine invertebrates, such as oysters, mussels, and crabs, are whoopy impaired, so that means that they do not fart. <laughs> well, that'll give me the opportunity to squeeze in an extra one, too, that I, it wasn't in my original list of 10. It was yeah. a backup. But jellyfish can't fart either. Ooh. And that's because they don't have an anus. Oh, what do they have? They have a mouth. <laughs> so I don't know. It goes in. I don't know how it goes out, though. And it comes out of the tentacles. <laughs> <laughs> so, do ferrets fart? Now, why do you get to do two and twice? Because it was related to yours. I was squeezing it in. No. Okay, that's your one. <laughs> no, I told so you. So, mine is, <laughs> do flies fart? No. No information found. Who would be trying to listen to if a, fart, if a fly fart? <laughs> you know what kind of, I know what kind of noise it would make if it did. What kind? It would go... <laughs> And it'll probably be sticky and smelly with some creatures. With some creatures. <laughs> oh, okay. So do ferrets fart? I would say yes, because aren't they like mammals? Yes, they are. Yes, so that yes, they do. And in fact, they are surprised by their own farts. Oh. <laughs> they get a confused look in the direction of their backside after they audibly pass gas. <laughs> 
<laughs> and do they see the fumes? <laughs> well, I don't know. They probably smell it. But you don't want a ferret to get really scared because their fear response involves screaming, puffing up, and simultaneously farting and pooping. Oh, wait a minute. Say that again. If a ferret gets scared, yeah. its fear response involves uh, screaming, puffing up, and simultaneously <laughs> farting and pooping. Well, here's my fun fact. Which animal has the smelliest fart? Andre. Oh. <laughs> well, I don't do those things. So, it must be John. Not according to what I heard. Oh. <laughs> and I mean that literally. Oh my goodness. Okay. Look, I might have to secretly record some segments where you can hear no. John. <laughs> no. 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 But I'm not denying it. Uh, I don't do those things. So, anyway, moving on. Well, I said moving on. <laughs> so, which animal has the smelliest fart? Well, Here's the answer and the explanation. Explanation. Okay. One might guess that the foulest smelling flatulence in the animal kingdom would belong to something of substantial size. An elephant, camel, or john. But a San Diego zookeeper stated that sea lions by far have the funkiest farts. Ooh. I know, right? It must be from all the fish. <laughs> so, anything to add? Any special, any bonuses? Well, since we're talking about fish, oh. do fish fart? Yes, they're mammals. No, they're not, not all fish are. Oh, well, whales are mammals. Right, but they're not fish. They live in the water, but they're not fish. We call them fish. Okay, whatever. What is no? So then no. <laughs> You're right, with just a few exceptions, such as herring. Herring okay. use farts to communicate. Wow. They aren't farts in the true sense, produced by gut bacteria, mm -hmm. but they expel air from their anus, which produces bubbles. <laughs> so it's, it's kind of like... Oh, kind of like the ones that you make when you're taking a bath. <laughs> Well, it's kind of like an un... They happen, and I hear something, and I go, Oh, John must be calling me. <laughs> the herring farts are kind of like an underwater form of smoke signals. <laughs> I was just going to say something about smoke. <laughs> Is that why we like smoked herring? <laughs> I wouldn't think so. Oh, okay. Well, is that... Do you have more? I do have more, but I think we've exhausted our 10. Right? Okay, yes, we've done our 10. So anyway, if you know of any other animals or insects that might fart or don't fart, leave a comment below and let us know what you think. <laughs> well, anyway, here's to the animals and the insects that fart and the ones that don't. <laughs> I was really shocked about the spider not farting. I would have assumed that spiders would fart. That's just so funny to me. Well, it's especially since some other insects fart. Yeah. So, anyway. Okay. Well, cheers. To fart or not to fart? Yes. That is <laughs> <That's>... the question. <laughs> so, anyway, you know what it's time for? It's, it's game, game time. time. Today's game is Who, Who Dealt, Dealt it? it? So we have to guess the artist behind a song, and it's from the 80s only, and within 30 seconds. And see, this isn't fair because he knows the 80s very well, and he <laughs> knows that that was the decade that I took a hiatus from listening to popular music, so <sighs> I'll probably embarrass myself. <laughs> okay, here we go. So... 30 seconds on the clock. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Who dealt it? The song is Rock With You, 1980. And the person has, is a part of a mega family. And 
Michael Jackson. Yes. This is also from 1980. Give me back my man. Give me back my man? Give me a clue. It's by a wacky group that you're not particularly fond of. Fox Money! The B 52s! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Okay, so we got that. Just under the wire. Yes. All right. Here we go. Who dealt it? 9 to 5, 1981. Dolly Parton. Yes. <laughs> okay, at least you're picking ones that I'm familiar with. I was trying to be sweet. You, okay, I All should right. give you credit for that. Here we go. Go ahead. See, I was, I was trying ahead, to be a little obscure. Ahead. New Toy, 1981. Yeah. Uh, it's uh, kind of a new wave sound. Duran Duran? Uh, it's a female. Pat Benatar. It, it was her uh, big hit for her. Sheena Easton? She goes, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I got a new toy. Oh, Missing oh, Persons. Oh. No. Lenny oh. Lovitch. I don't even know who that is. <laughs> oh, well. I don't know who that is. Okay, here we go. Who dealt it? Mickey, 1982. And she was a choreographer. She helped um, with the Grammys back in the 80s. She choreographed the Grammys. I think she even worked with Janet Jackson this is one that's for a while. Mickey, Mickey, you're so fine. You just go ahead and figure it out who is the artist. Yes. And it's a she. I was going to say she. a group, but it's an artist. No, it's, it's a, yeah. Okay. Well, it was Tony Basil. Mickey. Oh, oh. Mickey, you're so fine. I would have. So fine. I knew the song, but I didn't know the artist. I would have never guessed that in a million years. Okay. Here we go. Thirty seconds. 1984, Blasphemous Rumors. No, these are songs that were on the charts. <laughs> yeah, it was a hit. And give me a clue. It's by a, a group from England. Very, They wrote very dark music. Depeche Mode? Very good. <laughs> All right, here we go. Who dealt it? Girls Just Want to Have Fun, 1983. Cindy Lauper. Yes. <laughs> I'm being really kind, you aren't are. I? You are. Okay, here we go. Go ahead. Planet Earth, 1981. Duran Duran. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> and do you know where they got their name? Yes, from Barbarella. Yes, it was the name of that uh, crazy scientist who yes. played the organ. I love that song. Okay. And I love the movie. Who dealt it? And this is one of your favorite songs and movie, Footloose. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, Kenny Rogers? Nope, but close. Kenny won. <laughs> <laughs> You're chopping wood. You're in the forest and I'm have not houses I'm afraid of made I'm out of wood. Kenny Loggins. Yes. <laughs> Thanks for the clue. And that's his favorite movie. And Thanks, dance. Thanks for the clue, lady. Oh, are you going to show? Look out for a trick. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. The Big Picture, 1988. Oh, Tori Amos, known as, oh gosh, what was his name? That's right. Name? You've got to oh, get the name of the group. group. La, 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 oh, la, 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 la. Okay, but don't It say has this. her name in the. Yeah. In the Why name. can't Tori read? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, here we go. This is something that you have many of. Who dealt it? Part-time lover. <laughs> oh, um, Stevie Wonder. Yes. Woo, I'm shy, see? That's because he has many. <laughs> That's not nice. You said you were being sweet, and then you come up with a line like that. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, here we go. Gypsy, 1982. Oh, oh. the motels. No. Gypsy. Fleetwood Mac. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, good. You got it. <laughs> well, oh. Franklin, once again, you got to give us more time for playing these games. This was so much fun. I know, because I had two more. Yeah, I bet you, you thought that who dealt it was going to be about farts. <laughs> and if we know anybody who dealt it, it was either going to be Franklin or it was going to be John in the studio. So. <laughs> well, it could have been. Do you know the song, I Don't Like My Own Farts? No. Uh, it's by Pussycat Dolls. Oh, I don't even like that. I think the title is more or less. No. <laughs> but it's not 80s. Right. Well, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next week. And enjoy yourself, ice lady. But before we go, here is our feel good of the week. A photographer captured two penguins enjoying a nighttime skyline. <laughs> and here's what happened. A wildlife photographer captured two penguins who were widowed enjoying a nighttime vista. Yeah, the uh, two penguins had just lost their respective partners. Oh, that's so sad. Yeah, it is. But at least they were consoling each other. At least they're consoling each other during this time where they don't even know what the hell is going on. Or do they? <laughs> <laughs> they're waiting to take over. <laughs> well, if you want to see behind the scenes footage from our show, be sure and check out our Instagram account. And if you'd like to help support the channel, be sure to check out our Bat Talk merch. Links are in the description box below. And then take a selfie wearing or holding the merchandise. Oh yeah, be sure to subscribe, like, and comment below. And don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Hashtag, Hashtag Bat Talk. Well, that's it for this week. Be sure to tune in next time. And remember, always have an opinion, laugh, and, and don't, don't be afraid to Bat Talk. Cheers. They fart. <laughs> and if they do, what does it smell like? What does it sound like? <laughs> <laughs>